everybody, I'm Colleen, and today I'm gonna do something a little bit different than my average video. I've been wanting to redecorate my room for a while now, but I know nothing about redecorating things, and also I'm lazy, or I don't have time, one of the two. I didn't do a full-on room makeover, I didn't wanna buy new furniture, I just wanted to spice things up a little bit, and you guys really wanted to see what I'm doing, so I'm filming it. Why are you laughing at me? <laughs> so I know absolutely nothing about redecorating a room. I invited someone over who knows a lot about it, and his name is Eric Staglin! Eric is a very fashionable hipster man. You're only saying that because I build furniture out of wooden pallets, which I feel like a lot of people... Hipsters do that. Wait, is this like an actual video, or is this like... This is a real video! Oh! Now I feel depression. You feel depression? I feel the pressure. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> queen of mumbling, I never know what he's saying. I know absolutely nothing about home decorating, but I've been to your apartment and it's very cool and very hipster and he knows exactly what he's doing. He said he did it all himself, he built all his own furniture, he's like a master man. <laughs> so I asked him to help me with my room and he did an awesome job. I wanna show you guys, you, you wanna know what my contribution was to all of this? I bought pickles. He picked out everything and the only thing I picked out was a jar of pickles because Those I was pickles hungry. Pickles really tie the room together. They're gone, I ate them. All right, let's do a room tour. So this is my bedroom before all of our hard work. I don't know how to decorate a room. This is all leftover stuff from previous homes I've had, and I don't really enjoy being in my bedroom, which is why I wanted Eric's help to redo the bedroom. Trying to make a bed with a cat is impossible. keyboard up here and just like piles of stuff and Eric turned it into the cat corner so I have these cat trees that are disgusting if you look nice and close there's a lot of clumps of fur he figured out a way to make this area look cute first of all he got these cute you're so close to me that's how he did on cribs on cribs so oh my god he got these cute little yellow rugs they were on sale they were on special we got this very fancy marble plate for the cats to have their food and water bowl and these cute pink dishes he also got this really cute, what is this thing called? A dresser? An armoire. An armoire? I thought that was what's on the arms of a chair. That's not the arms on a chair, an armoire? <laughs> No. This is a Bed Bath & Beyond, but what I needed was something to hold cat food in because there was just cans everywhere in my bedroom. So now it holds all of my cat food for the kitty cats and it hides them in this cute little thing. Eric added this knob, which is something I would never know to do. Knob life. Knob life. Hashtag knob life. Why did I do this? <laughs> so this is the cat corner. <laughs> What you reading? <laughs> what you reading? Sorry, I was so engrossed in this book. <laughs> yes. What inspired you to do this cute little pink corner? They want to, to, are they paying us? It's bed, bath, no, you can say you whoever. Them. Not sponsored. Uh, can they pay me though? <laughs> yeah, I'll ask like, them. Let's be honest. You have white, and what, what I was thinking was, how do we hide all the cat hair and cat? <laughs> <laughs> everyone. So he wanted a color and he liked this like dusty rose color and I never would have picked something like that out That's very not me, but now that it's in here. I'm like, this is so cool. It's so me rugs I love they're so cozy and soft like you have no idea and this chair I never would have picked out this chair super funky and cool And I like the fuzzy pillow and where did you even find this? It was at Nordstrom Rack. That was at Nordstrom are they, Rack. Are they gonna give us money? No one's gonna give us money <sighs> Not even YouTube. I need money for the rack. This plan is is going to be dead very soon. You can water a plant once a week. I'm not gonna remember. <gasps> <laughs> I love this. I do. This is my favorite part. This whole area is just incredible. I don't know how you came up with it. I never would have picked a pink colored sheet and then this random like grandma looking thing. I never would have picked these out. Quilt, quilt. It's a quilt? Mm -hmm. Shut up. <laughs> and the pillows, like I never would have picked out these pillows in like the dark blue with the light pink. But when you put it all together, it just looks amazing. You did such a good job. The best part is that the kitty cats love it. That's all that matters. He also picked out these lampshades. And then he also got these cute little flowers that he put all over the room, purple and pink, which I think are super cute. Get ready for the best part of the room. I told Eric I wanted pictures of my cats in here. And 
and he follows my cats on Instagram. You guys should all go do that. And he loves the pictures of Gus and Daisy like laying on their backs and just looking fat. So he found the best pictures of them, cut them out, like cut out each individual hair and put it on this like cloud blue paper with this really cool gold frame. And it looks so bizarre and so cool. I love it. It's my favorite part of the entire room now. I'm obsessed with this. What made you think to do this? The cats, I mean, they're always like in the photos you post like lying on their backs. And then I went to Michael's craft store. Are they giving us money? <laughs> no, no one's giving us no money. No one's giving us money for this. It's so weird. I don't know how you thought of it, but it's amazing. I'm obsessed. One other thing that Eric did as a total bonus surprise and is super awesome is I have a balcony right outside of my bedroom and I never use it. There was literally one broken lawn chair on it and it was just a total waste of space. And he just threw together some cool stuff and made it look super awesome out there. First of all, there's this like wooden frame that's super cool and it has little fairy lights on it. There's a nice little sitting area, a little chair and then a bench with some succulents. Eric loves a succulent like a good old hipster. This awesome cat potted plant and he painted this to look like Gus while he was pet sitting for me last weekend. And my favorite part of the entire balcony is this little planter that looks like the bike from Haters Back Off. He even put flowers in it that look like bubble gum from the froze toes. It is so special, I'm obsessed with this. But yeah, this is just a really cool space to just kind of hang out and watch the sunset over a parking lot of a grocery store. Should we see what it looks like at night? So this is what it looks like at night. Like he built this thing. Yeah, that was a wooden pallet from behind Ralph's. Behind Ralph's paying us? Ralph's is not paying us. He also built this little foot thing. Eric has screwed himself over because now I'm gonna make him do every single room in my house. And this is my room, baby. What do you guys think? I think Eric did a good job. Oh, it's not finished. It's not finished. Well, because like we didn't do your contribution. What's my contribution? Because you also helped decorate it. Eric. <laughs> You idiot. Literally the only thing I picked out was a jar of pickles and Yeah, where do you think? I hate you. I was hungry and pickles sounded good. Oh my oh, god. Now it's what this taught me is that you don't have to buy all new furniture to make your room feel totally new and different and refreshed. Just with like some cheap new pillows and some new pictures and a little chair in the corner. Like the room feels totally awesome and better. So thank you so much. Are you happy? I'm very happy. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure to thumbnail. Yeah, we gotta make a thumbnail. Eric's uh, not very privy to the internet. No, just kidding. Oh. Listen, be like. And you look like surprised, but also like shocked. Did you do it? What did you do? I, I did like, uh, like shocked and also like. <laughs> Thanks for watching everybody. Make sure to subscribe. I post videos all the time. I'm on tour, so get tickets and come see me. Eric's gonna come to a couple shows. I just scared him away. He's a little scared of the internet. So this is terrifying for him to be in a video of mine. Thanks, Eric. Follow us on social media. Do all the things. Share this video with all your friends. Let me know what your favorite part of the new room is. And I love you guys. I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Yeah.